close the place down. Hey everyone, welcome to today's video where today we are at a CC's Pizza. So if you're not familiar with the CC's Pizza, CC's Pizza is an all-you-can-eat pizza restaurant. Um, they also have a small salad bar as you saw at the beginning, also a small selection of pastas. Then they have also a small selection of desserts which are generally consisting of kind of like cinnamon bites, brownies, and then uh, dessert pizzas, which they have in two flavors, one being a Bulgarian cream and the other being a apple pie kind of thing. So we showed up at 8.30. As Google said, they were open until 10 o'clock. Salad, they say salad. Yeah, definitely salad. But to our unfortunate finding and our dismay, the restaurant was actually only open until 9. Um, again, we had no prior way to know this besides I guess calling the restaurant which again we just were assuming Google was correct so showing up at 8 30 we literally only had 30 minutes to do like literally what we could for this buffet so the buffet is a standard cost for adults it's only six dollars which is super super affordable as you saw when we walked in there were very few options but we weren't the only one coming in at that time there was another group as well um, and you can go up to the counter like to the restaurant staff and request items so we went up there and just like requested like dessert pizzas brownies cinnamon bites and then we were just like just make pizzas like we don't really care what kind just make them um, we also if you haven't noticed I went up and literally took everything off the buffet like I'm serious we cleared that thing um, you know hence me starting with mini Minimum five plus plates there. They had kind of the red plates, which are the bigger ones, um, intended for the desserts, or sorry, intended for the main meals, and then these yellow plates intended for the desserts. We just stuck with the red plates uh, for the most part, even for desserts and other items, because we weren't messing around. We were just going in there to destroy and dominate as much as we could. So again, I started off with a salad, went within a large variety of pizzas. The ones I had were kind of like a uh, like a garlic bread or a garlic pizza. Um, I had this kind of Italian Mediterranean style pizza on a very thin crust so far. I had a deep dish uh, pepperoni pizza. There was just kind of a standard meat lovers pizza right there. Um, the gentleman beside me were having uh, macaroni and cheese pizza. Also a buffalo pizza was another one um, that we had, which was really good actually. I think that was my favorite pizza from this experience, the, uh, the pizza that is. And that was literally it. We were being very, very aggressive. Again, we were at this point the only ones really eating in the restaurant. The other kind of people came up and took the items they wanted. So we were being very aggressive, literally just going up and as soon as something was brought uh, up to the, the counter there, just literally taking it all. Again, we had half an hour to get our money's worth. So I got a couple pieces of dessert pizza. This is one of the, uh, which was good. It was the Bulvarian cream. Um, very, very sweet, but a really nice flavor. I don't know how to describe it. It was almost like it's like a pudding on a cake. And then had some cinnamon bites. Here I went up, grabbed some pizza. If you can't tell, I'm literally putting like four or five slices um, per plate. Literally just like going, you know, like I said, being pretty outrageous, way over the top. Multiple plates at the same time. Very, very full plates. Um, again, just being very aggressive. Um, you know, a over this buffet again nobody else was in the restaurant it's not like we were being uh, inconsiderate of anybody else we just wanted to get as much as we could in that only short 30 minute minute window um, so 30 minutes basically as much as we could eat as per as much as they could keep on that counter every time we went up to we were always like requesting items again dessert pizzas um, normal pizzas you saw the time just there is 8:41, um, which I will say they were creating these pizzas in like I'd say about five minutes. We'd go up and request a pizza, and it'd be up in probably like five to eight minutes. So that was super quick. Um, but now we only had less than 20 minutes left, and we like we wanted to fill up. We weren't planning on stopping here. Um, for beverages, they, we just kind of got waters. They did have soda, but you had to pay for that. So we just said, hey, we'll just do waters tonight. <coughs> This is a whole dessert pizza. <laughs> so these dessert pizzas was definitely, again, like 
I say the buffalo is my favorite um, kind of actual pizza, and then these dessert pizzas was my favorite dessert of the uh, options. There's the apple one, and then the Bulgarian cream. I really like the Bulgarian cream. Um, the apple one was just exceptionally sweet. Like, like I really like sweet things, but it was too sweet. That was the Bulgarian cream. Um, really, really good. Like I said, it was almost like a cream pie. Um, there were some of the cinnamon bites. And like I said, I mean, I literally up and went up and just took the whole dessert pizza. The dessert pizzas they were making, they were smaller. I'd say they're only like, I don't know, 9 inches or 12 inches. Um, whereas like the actual pizzas they were making were probably more like that 16 mark. Um, and then the actual pizzas were cut in bigger slices. The dessert pizzas were cut in a lot smaller pieces. As I, again, I assume, they would assume the average individual doesn't want that much of their dessert pizza you know and so a small slice for the average individual would probably do hence also them giving you smaller plates for desserts instead of me also going up and taking half a tray of the cinnamon buns or cinnamon bite things that they had there which was essentially just like cooked dough with cinnamon sugar and then a little bit of an icing on top here again we're back to more pizzas because they had more up there also grab some of the brownies um, the brownies, they weren't actually cooked, like, they must have really rushed them. So, like, the brownies were just soft, like, mush. Uh, whereas, again, there's kind of Mediterranean pizza, the hard, firm thin crust again. Also, had some normal pepperoni pizzas. And really, like I said, anything that they had up on the table, no matter the kind of pizzas, we were just taking it. I mean, obviously, to answer your question, no, we weren't really, like... I mean, you know, we were enjoying it as much as we could, and to an extent. Um, not that I would ever really say CC's is like exceptional quality. It's quite comparable to like, I mean like a Pizza Hut buffet in a way. Like I've been to a Pizza Hut buffet and this was very comparable. Although here I will say they had a lot more uh, different kind of varieties. <laughs> I should just take the whole tray. <laughs> Should've <laughs> And by varieties, I don't just mean like kind of kinds of pizza, like with toppings, but here they had like a whack of different um, deep dish, they had thin crust, they had um, like kind of almost like a flatbread pizza at one point. So yeah, like definitely a lot of different varieties. Another whole dessert pizza. Well, minus two pieces. What did you leave the two pieces? And buffalo chicken. Yeah. <laughs> And like I said, I mean, we were being nice, like I left two pieces up there in case anybody else wanted it, but at this point for sure we were the only ones eating in the restaurant. Um, again, this buffalo pizza was one of the ones that we requested, and I really enjoyed it. Um, it had some buffalo sauce on it, they kind of had this like, I guess it was ranch dressing on it as well, which I didn't really care for that much as much, but I am a big buffalo uh, fan, so I love the taste like buffalo sauce. And then, I mean, have a little bit of chicken on there. Yeah, it's all good. I mean, of course, this pizza is mostly just dough. No, this is not like exceptional quality pizza. You go because it's $6 and it's an all-you-can-eat buffet. You know, so, and that was exactly why we went. So CC's is mostly in the southern United States. Um, we went to this one. This one was in Erie, Pennsylvania. Fun fact, there's only like three in all of Pennsylvania. Um, one is in Erie, so it's the only one kind of north and eastern uh, Pennsylvania at all and then there's the other two are around Philadelphia so south and uh, east sorry yeah this is the only one in northwest in Erie and then the other one is southeast um, in Philadelphia um, so yeah so we like we had to go we we're on the way to Pittsburgh and we were like ah, it's the only CC's around here because there's also none in you know in, in and around uh, I don't think there's actually any in New York at all so at this point we essentially had two minutes left on the clock um, we did know that or we kind of like clarified with them that like the pizza that was left up on the actual table like they'd leave a like at least for a few minutes for us so I, I, my plan is kind of just finish this dessert pizza um, and then probably go up and get really the remainder of what I could before I mean, they officially, like, kicked us out because at this point they were, like, very, very closed, as you can tell. Uh, so officially we were here to shut the place down, you know, in more than one way figuratively. But definitely joking, these people totally thought we must have been out of our minds. So coming on the end of our little visit here, I went and grabbed some more of the uncooked brownies, which really were 
I mean, I'll be honest, they were horrible. They weren't good at all. Um, again, the Bulgarian pizza was by far the best dessert. All of it was exceptionally sweet, I mean, the desserts. But, hey, it was all good. Um, went and just grabbed a couple other normal-ish pieces of pizza uh, that were kind of remainders up there. And kind of just prepared again to, at this point, we were on the down. Um, had definitely quite a few plates eaten. Uh, still probably a little bit more to, you know, come, obviously, with a little bit on my plates. But with that, everybody, hope you enjoyed watching us uh, officially kind of shut down a CC's. It was uh, quite an experience. My first time actually at CC's. Um, is it my last time at CC's? Mm, I mean, again, I wouldn't go leisurely. I would go if I was going to do another video. Um, perhaps, well, let me know down below in the comments if you'd like me to do another video at CC's. Hopefully when it's not about to close, when I can kind of take more time, we could eat more, probably enjoy it a little bit more. So yeah, let me know in the comments down below. Should I do another CC's run? Or should we just never look back at CC's? Look at that belly. It's good, uh, I don't know. Seven and a half, eight months, seven and a half at least. something like that. <laughs> that's gonna be my that's gonna be the intro of my video. <laughs> place down. It was alright. It was just, it was CC's. It, it was six bucks. That's all I'm really going to say to that. So, yeah, anyway, hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Appreciate it. If you want six dollar pizza, apparently you go to CC's. So everybody's still happy. Uh, until next time, say happy, healthy, hungry. And happy eating. We closed down CC's.